Jerry Adams casts his vote in the Irish Republic's general election. Exit polls suggest support for his party, Sinn Féin, has almost doubled since the last election. Fianna Gael looks set to continue as the largest party in the government. However, polls suggest the party will only have a narrow lead over its main rival, opposition party Fianna Fáil. Watchers say there's very little chance for the outgoing Fianna Gael Labour coalition to be returned. Voters are torn between continuing austerity and the threat of political instability. I think there's been small changes. I think there's been um, a bit of progression, but I don't think there's been enough. I think added to that would be the, the homelessness crisis. Um, you know, if there was enough work out there, if people were going out and getting work, I don't think we would be facing those kind of issues. Well, a lot of people don't see, see the recovery, you know. They, they don't see it. All they see is extra taxes, water taxes. Water charges is probably one of the big ones. It's probably why they, they did punish it. Attention will now focus on negotiations to form a new government. A deal between Sinn Féin and either of its centre-right rivals appears unlikely. A correspondent says 80 seats are needed for an absolute majority in the Irish Parliament. We'll have to wait for the final results as the transferable voting system means some parties have a bonus quota. Several scenarios are possible and intense negotiations are expected in the Irish political world.